Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're, uh, we're back playing Decked Out 2. Gonna give this, a, give this a try and see how this run goes. Hopefully it doesn't go too poorly. <laughs> gonna try to kind of wear out my um, hunger as always. Just so we can get um, get the golden carrot and eat it before our run. Okay, let's go. Position. Uh, yeah, and I got my Ember Seeker, which just gives me Ember uh, plus two Ember. So hopefully, hopefully things go well. We'll see. Another level 1 artifact would be nice for this time around. Preferably not a level 2. Okay, screw me, I guess. Um. Don't tell me it's fucked up. Okay. Treasure Hunter. Oh, shoot. That's bad. That's really bad. Oh, that's even worse. I mean, that's the strategy I'm going to keep going for, though, is is go basically straight for um, that area and then just kind of hope for the best. But dang, yeah, that, that sucks. I didn't realize, yeah, I just, I did not realize that. But yeah, I think, okay, so, okay, a couple of different strategies so far. So, eat a gold carrot before a run, so your saturation is as high as it possibly can be. Um, go, okay, and then basically go directly to that shortcut into the, from, from the ice area in, directly into the, the key room. Um, and I think that's what we're going to be doing from now on. Let's go to spawn, grab our starter. Go back here. Grab the moment thing. Throw that back in there. Get a frozen shard. Put that in there. Break it. Okay. Ready to go. Ready to go. Just need to lower my my saturation so that I'm I'll be hungry enough to eat a golden carrot. And okay, now we have another person. 
that you kind of try to compete with. But it should be fine. The dungeon is ready for its next victim. anything I don't I think I took everything out yep yeah, okay everything should be good now fingers hoping for a level one artifact see level two wouldn't be so bad but like you know level one is just okay level one's a little bit easier okay so all you have to do is go through here follow the compass I think going through here is always a pretty good idea. Wait. Now I just gotta make my way out. Moment of clarity. be easy enough. Okay, well, I guess there's an Enderman. So. Not sure why, why that's there, but sure. I'll take it. <laughs> Not gonna question it. So that one was worth 11. Yep, so we got 11 from that. So I'm not, because this says I'm supposed to get plus 2, but I'm assuming the plus 2 just means that it drops somewhere in the map, which, which uh, kind of sucks. And then this one's ethereal. So we need to be 
careful of that, not to get something that has a fear in it. I think I'm gonna go for, I'll go, actually, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with another, another Frost Embers. Really try to increase the chance of me getting, uh, getting these. I don't know what this thing is, though. I wish I could find out. Oh yeah, I don't get like a crown or anything like that, right? I'm gonna take the path of the cow. Yeah, I didn't have any coins or anything. Hello, sir. Ow. So all my stuff should be in there. Okay, nice. Throw that in there. Throw our jar in there. Go back to spawn. Grab another one of these. At this point, I'm just gonna have a bunch of shulker boxes with random things in it. All right. The dungeon is ready for its next victim.
Okay, sorry. Sorry that I'm not talking much. I'm just kind of trying to explain this to this person. Alright. So yeah, let's watch this person. This is their first run, so we'll see how this goes. Not a bad idea having them, having it in the offhand. I didn't really think about that. Moment of clarity. I mean, there's not Sneak. too many pathways to take. Why not? Hold on. Why not fit through there? Should be able to. They're like two blocks wide. Where did uh, what glasses go? Okay, my bad, my bad. They probably don't want any more hit tips, so I'm not gonna say too much. I'm not gonna spoil too much of the adventure, I guess. I'll let them just experience it. I think they're getting enough. <laughs> probably getting. Oh! They took a hit from the. Ravager. Oh, they, they're just booking it. They're going for it. Oh, but these, the Ravager's following him. I think it's a hit. Kinda looks like it, I think. I oh, know, the skin is so dark. It's really since when did the water? Oh, unless it's always like that and it's just a hazard that blocks it. Oh, that's interesting. That's a new pathway to take. Okay. I think, I, I don't think it's really all that safe, but definitely one that you can take, I guess. Ooh, watch out for the Oh, watch out for the for the magma blocks, which I have been victim to many times. <laughs> Usually, repeatedly, <laughs> repeatedly being demolished by the magma blocks as they suck me down into the water. Let's see, hot, <laughs> hot. We got hot breath over here. Hot breath actually is stuck. No, they should be able to fit. Oh, there's a ravager right there. Yep. I'm surprised he had enough health to survive that. He must have gotten quite a few berries. Oh, you're not in a good spot, dude. Oh no. Oh my gosh, this is this is a ring around the rosy situation. You got yeah, you gotta just kinda wait for him to alert. God damn.
that, yeah, that was that was rough. That was really rough. Yeah, Ivan can go next. And then I'll go after him. Wait, let me... Oh, oh, The dungeon is ready for its next victim. Got everything from there. Oh. We're gonna go that, that, that. Okay. I'm gonna kind of just keep doing this at least until I kind of consistently get a win, so I can kind of learn the area a little bit more. Level two, great. in my face. Oh, um... Gotta go around this way, I guess. See if I can... Can I swim? Moment of clarity. Doesn't seem like it. I'm just gonna have to look it this way, I guess. I just realized, I guess it doesn't really matter if you eat. Yeah, they're right. It, it just... 
your hunger does just uh start or refresh or whatever you want to call it. Okay, that guy's coming towards me. Okay, well that's not very nice. Come on, there's the key. Oh, was that a raptor right there? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. How did... Okay. I don't know how I didn't get hit from that, but, okay, up to this one, okay, hitting me through the floor, about being quiet. Yep, there he is. I was gonna say I was pretty sure there was a rap. are hitting me through the floor that hurt a lot <laughs> yeah I guess I, I guess I should have realized that the it doesn't really matter to eat the gold carrot because your hunger does reset so I guess there's really no point but yeah I still think going straight I think by the second strategy I had makes a lot of sense though to like you know go for uh just go directly into that pathway, the, the, the shortcut. I think that's a good idea. Yeah, the level 2 artifact area, that's going to be rough. Especially, like, with the first room being, like, full of lava and stuff, like. And then the soul of sand just makes it so much more difficult as well. Are they AFK? Seems like it. If they're AFK, then I'm just gonna go again. Like it seems like they are. I feel like it just makes sense to bring the moment of clarity with you. Button of shame. The dungeon is ready for its next victim. Or uh, is glass? everything I need then I mean I can it's not like I can really bring anything else so I'm just gonna bring what I got hope for the best uh make sure the spawn point is set okay
I probably should have reset the positions of the end of their ravagers because I'm pretty sure they can re they stay in the area so you don't press it then they'll just stay where they were which might become a problem okay level one this. So let's just try to like a speed run this. Clank doesn't really matter until you get too much of it. So let's just run through here. Don't really care. Ravager there though. Oh, maybe it's just that the ice melted or something. Ah, uh, yeah, you're gonna... Mr. Ravager, I'm gonna just run past you as long as you don't mind. Okay. I think I'm gonna just. I mean, get 12. I mean. Alright. I mean, I have one on me. Should I, should I buy this? I mean, I don't know what it is. But, I mean, I could still buy it. But... And I get, oh, I'll leave it up to check, I guess. I don't just care, because we'll see what it is. Um, I could buy another. I don't really need it. Not enough to buy it, but can we still get it? Can I get a discount? No? Okay. That's good. It was worth a try. I wonder if you can like escape that area before before dying. We got our stability. Let's uh, put it in there. Okay, we got our... Just so hard. Um, still have our moment of clarity, so it actually, so we didn't actually have to use it during that. Surprisingly. And then since Ivan seems to still be AFK, we're just gonna. Queue up next, I guess. Mm -hmm. 
The dungeon is ready for its next victim. Now we have stability. So that should help with, like, obviously the hazards. So if there's any hazards or anything like that, then we'll get rid of it. Uh, I mean, I wonder how often the cards do get used. Because if they get, if it could just like use the Ember Seekers like right away from the beginning, that would be really nice. happy about this because we can just quickly basically sp sprint through this area oh, Rapture is blocking the doorway that I would normally take so let's just go this way instead there's that Rapture there She didn't throw me back. Oh wait, I passed it? Still alive, okay. Please tell me if it's wrong. If you, what if you take fall damage there and I just died? Oh my gosh. Oh. I took the hit from the Ravager. It's just, uh... That said it was worth 11, but I got 7, I got 13 from that, interesting, okay. Oh, I unlocked some more cards. Okay. Ooh, what's this one? Oh, the Revelation, that's ethereal, oh, okay. Any more cards I can get? Maybe, please, hopefully. 
really be appreciated if you would. Okay, so I could get, uh, I'm gonna get one of these and one of these. Okay, I'm gonna get both of those. Okay. We're just gonna die from the fall damage anyway. Yep. <laughs> Okay, now we can throw those in there. Okay, we're looking pretty good so far. It still seems like he's AFK. Um, I guess if he wants to go next, then... This is probably going to be my last run. So I'm just going to wait for this to be available and then I'm going to call it quits, I think. The dungeon okay. is ready for its next victim. Doesn't seem like Ivan wants to go. I mean, this is my last run anyway, so I guess. What is it doing now? If he wants to go, he can just go after I go. <laughs> That might have been why that one Ravager wasn't where he usually would be. Like, why, I, I think that's why he was, like, in the doorway instead of, like, being away from it. I think it's because I didn't put default mob positions. I'm pretty sure he's supposed to. Let me guess, it's going to be a level 2 artifact. Level 1? Dang, they're being nice to me on my last run. I'll take it. Yeah, see, so you're supposed to spawn over there. So I think it was actually just made harder by the fact that I didn't set them back to their normal positions. What do I do here? Bro. Okay. Punching does nothing. Shoot, I gotta go this way. Like, I know I can survive a hit, but... I didn't really want to have to do that. Freedom going through this area. Okay, 
guess it's worth 11. that I got. Be happy with it. <laughs> we're doing good. We're we're getting we're getting these level one artifact wins. So our deck is, you know, it's developing nicely. Oh. Alright. Oh yeah, I just need to get uh, the moment of clarity. Dungeon is ready for its next victim. Okay. Right. Yeah, I'm gonna head off, so. Um, but yeah, if you guys wanna check out, um, Decked Out 2, this is the unofficial server that they have. Um, I highly recommend downloading the mod pack. It's from CurseForge. It's literally just called Decked Out 2. You guys can add your own mods if you want to. And, uh, yeah, my name is Sam, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. You guys take care.